This is going to be the last time that I'll have an opportunity to show off my Helioptile card collection before Phantom Gate releases in Japan and I start getting that version of Helioptile cards. So I figured as a final farewell to having a binder completely of only one kind of Helioptile card, why not just show off what I've got right now to all of you guys. So here we go. Come on camera, focus. You were having problems last time. I do not accept that. Here we go. Anyway, we've got uh, these two... Jump Festa Japanese cards. I'm looking for one more to help complete my set. So, yeah, just throwing that out there. I know that they're on eBay, but I really don't want to spend $15 on one right now. Maybe later when I start getting money from YouTube again. See previous video for more info. Anyway, and then also here I have a bunch of custom cards that people have made for me. Uh, first of all, over here I do have this uh, giant Mega Zippy EX card that I have in regular print over there. Um, that someone put. I just put it in a nice little slot right there. Then I got this awesome lightning energy with helioptile. <laughs> I thought that's pretty cool. Anyway, let's look at these. We have an awesome full art Zippy EX and every single custom card you see here were sent to me by my fans and I am so blessed to, to be part of a community where people just make art and send them to other people for free just because they're fans. So that's really, really awesome. We got uh, Full Art Zippy EX here, and if you want to see what each of these cars does, just pause the video. And I have shown them off in previous videos as well. We got a uh, Helioptile EX, one of the awesome, most awesome realistic cards I've ever seen. Uh, of course, we got the Mega Zippy EX again that we had on the other page. Uh, this is Mega Helioptile. <clears throat> Sorry. We have another Full Art Zippy EX. Uh, Helioptile EX Full Art, uh, Full Art Zippy, uh, just a regular Zippy there, and then that's a Dragon Type Mega Zippy, that's such awesome art, <laughs> Skulls Zippy, which is the, uh, uh, that, that's the picture of the, uh, Zippy plush that I have, except mine is real, it's not a plush, we've got, uh, a Zippy Level X over here, people getting really creative with some of the older cards, we got a Zippy here, using the actual photo from Flashfire, the, the print. And then we've got a really awesome, kind of hard to see, but each of these little things is actually popping out of the card. It's like they took those out and glued it on. So, um, yeah, this that's just really, really awesome. That's uh, just a just regular Zippy. I call that more like a, uh, I don't know, Zippy Prime, maybe? Anyway, over here we have a... Uh, Helioptile and Arceus EX Legend. Such an awesome card. <laughs> People get really creative when sending cards to me. And then the final custom card I have so far is this Zippy card, which is basically identical to the one from Flashfire, except it's Zippy, not Helioptile. So that's um, basically all my custom cards for now. I know I'll get several more in the years ahead, but uh, that's all I have for now. And I do appreciate each... Uh, each each custom card you guys send me. I ne I have never asked for a custom card. I've never asked for anything as far as free cards go, and you guys just blow me out of the water every single time. So I am very, very thankful to all of you for that. Anyway, here we go. Um, th we're going to start here with my actual Helioptile collection. I mean, these were real cards, but <laughs> you want to see my um, gorge, uh, huge, humongous <laughs> collection of real cards, don't you? So here we go. This is first edition Wild Blaze. We have 9, 18, 27, 36, 45, 54, 63, 72, 81, 90, 99, 108, 117, 119. First edition Wild Blaze. I am missing the Unlimited Wild Blaze. Um, I, again, I've never asked for any, but... So, uh, just throwing that out there. That's about the only edition of Helioptile I'm currently missing right now that's actually been released. Phantom Gate doesn't officially release until tomorrow in Japan, so... Yeah. Anyway, so now we're getting into the my pride and joy, my English Helioptiles. This is from Flashfire. This is just the regular print, not the reverse hollows. Those come later. 9, 18, 27, 36, and I pointed this out before. This one used to be a square cut before someone tried to shave it off before giving it to me. 
I completely lost count. That's 45. No, I'll start again. 9, 18, 27, uh, 36. Yeah, good thing I restarted. That's 45. 54. And this is so heavy, it's just sliding down my lap. 54, 63, 72, 81, 90, 99, 108, 117, 126, 135, 144, 153, 162, 171, 180, 189, 198, 207, 216, 225, actually that's where it ends, 225 English flash fire helioptiles. So combine that with the 2 in front and the 119, and that's where I'm at right now, plus 125. And then here are my reverse helioptiles, again from Flash Fire. Uh, this is easy enough to count. That is number 16. So I have 16 of those, plus 2 of the first one, that's 18, plus 119, that's 137, plus 125, that is, no, 225, that is, oh, 127 plus 225. Let me think about that. Uh, 352. That's how many helioptile cars I have right now. And that's only from basically these two sets and two promo cards from the beginning. That's really awesome. Two, 352 helioptile cards. I'm so thrilled to have all those. Then of course I got my small Heliolisk collection. I do love the Heliolisk from Phantom Gate. It looks beautiful. I can't wait to get a few of those. This is not a priority as many of you know. Um, Heliolisk is just something that I'm collecting on the side. But I do have from first edition Wild Blaze 10 Hollow Heliolisk, then Reverse Hollow in English from Flashfire 3, and then 3 Shard Hollows from the theme deck, and 6 non hollow Rares. So that's my Helioptile collection so far. I'm looking forward to um, probably having to get a new binder to hold all of the ones that I get in the future. Thank you all so much for each and every one of you who have sent me Helioptile cards. Most of these that I have gotten as free cards from from a bunch of bunch of people but even if you send me one it helps my collection grow and I am absolutely floored to be part of a community where you just want to send me stuff to help me get my collection not because you want recognition that then that really says something about Pokemon and I am very very thrilled to be part of that so I hope this update video was nice for you guys I really don't know what to do in the meantime between now and uh, Phantom Forces the English release I'll find stuff to do. I'll probably do a few discussions of the day. But anyway, um, that pretty much does it for this video. Thanks everyone for watching. Stay tuned for more.